Hi guys, welcome to Tech Game 180 today. I've got a review of the Overboard Waterproof Multipurpose Case Medium Size. So let's take a quick look at the catalogue. So you do get this catalogue in your mail package and this basically has all, I believe, all of the um, Overboard products what they do. The Overboard products are pretty good because they arrange from waterproof cases to multipurpose bags and all of these, I believe, most of the stuff is waterproof also. And as you can see, it's quite a lot of selection to choose from. So that's just a quick look at the catalogue. Now let's move on to the actual review of the product. And there's the back of the catalogue also. So let's just take a quick look around the box. So at the top of the box, as you can see, it tells you there how uh, submergible it is. This says six foot and then it's got keep it dry. And also it says it floats there and as you can see it's just a see through window there with the overboard logo there and also the another overboard logo there with a picture of somebody I believe yep yeah, somebody carrying the case because you do get a carry strap with it. Just get the focus a bit there. As you can see there. And then it says waterproof medium multi-purpose case and medium. Uh, now onto the side where it says Hopefully you can read that. And I mean it's got just the old B to stand for old board. On the back it gives you a bit of product information. Thank you. Gives you a bit of product information. I'm not going to read all that out if you just pause the video and read it. And there it's that's what it can do. So it's uh, so it says it's sandproof dust proof, snow proof and waterproof and then on the other side of that uh, as you can see it does does give the centimeters of the case that is it for around the case so let's actually crack into it so when you first open it you will actually get the case uh, I'm just going to put that to one side because there is stuff underneath it So as you can see underneath it you will get a you will get a like, instruction manual. This tells you this just uh, tells you how to how to like uh, do it, how to close the case and stuff like that. I will do a live demonstration of me submerging with a couple of stuff in, so like my phone or something like that. So, um as, and then you do get an old board sticker, so that'll be that's cool just to stick on somewhere. Uh, you can stick it onto the case I believe. That's why it might be for, but I'll probably stick it on the right side of my computer or something. And then you also get a carry strap, so so you can hook it onto a belt or something. Uh, hopefully you can see that. And then also just a I believe this is a neck strap. Or a neck, yeah, it's a neck strap. I'll, yeah, I believe that. Yeah, I believe that's a neck strap, so you can carry it around with you. And then that's just that's it for inside the box. So let's get over to the case. The case feels really um, good. The only problem I would probably have with this case is when you open it, is on the inside. It does feel like that would break after a couple of uses, but it's probably just me. Um, as you can see, this is medium size, so you can get small and you can get large. The medium is fairly big, it could probably fit my um, Samsung Galaxy S3, uh, probably the S4 also with a couple more things. Um, they have got something on their website what size they can fit. They can fit some keys in, they can fit money in, they can fit the credit cards in, lighters, they can also fit an iPod in and also the passports in just the medium case. So. If they can fit all that in, that's really, really cool. And this is like a must-have accessory then if you can fit all that in on holiday so nothing gets wet. You want to take them out. You don't want to keep them in the hotel, but you want to take them out with you. And you want to go swimming. So you don't have to just leave them lying somewhere. You can take it, you can take them with you up to six metres. So that's a really cool. Um, so let's get on to the me putting my phone in there. Join me back in a second for that. Hi guys, welcome back. So now as you can hopefully see, I have put my phone into the case. I was going to record it 
uh, from the phone, but because the case is um, like it's got like a tint, it's not really working through the camera. But and also a good feature, what I have found out is the case is fully clickable. You can fully control your phone with it, and that is really cool. So let's get it submerged. Uh, how to do it is all you do is just you just pop these clips open, and then you can open it and just put the case in, and then make sure that clips back, and then just make sure these clips are fully closed. You will have to give them a bit of a hard um, like push to get them closed, but that's just to make sure it is definitely closed. So let's do my phone in. Now uh, I'm going to show you how to open it properly and how to get it out without damaging anything inside so like any paper or anything like that and my phone obviously uh, because there is a special way of how to get it out so we'll be back for that So as you can see I've just moved it over to my draining board uh, to like, dry in the tea towel so all you do is just wipe the case, just dry it off uh, just dry it off and then how to open it is basically what you do is you hold that oops sorry it down so all the water trapped in there will go basically onto the case upside down and all the water trapped in will just drip out it doesn't drip and then just quickly pull your item out and as you can see due uh, speckles of wa water just just because I pulled it out it is fully dry it is fully working so yeah I'm really impressed with that case to be honest I didn't think it would stand up to a lot of water but it can stand up to six meters i probably do agree with that now as i've seen it in action myself so yeah guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the review and the little water test don't forget to hit up overboard on their facebook and this i'll put the prices down on the description and also don't forget to comment on the video what you thought don't forget to like it and don't forget to subscribe yeah guys thanks for watching bye